What is going on guys? So today I got a quick video and it's about uBlock Origin. So we see that it's no longer supported in Google Chrome. It's also no longer supported in Edge, but it still is in Firefox. So if this is something that you want to use still, you can use it in Firefox and that is the most common solution you'll see online. Just use Firefox. But today we're going to be talking about alternatives since this is no longer supported. So number one, you can continue using it. Um, you'll just have to keep ignoring all the suggestions Chrome's making. Oh, this is no longer supported. There's always a little option that you can click learn more or see more and enable it. I'll make a video on that separately, but for today's video, we're going to talk about alternatives. So we're going to see another ad blocker on Google Chrome that can do the same thing, block YouTube ads, block web page ads and work the same. So one that's trusted. Um, Really quick, I'm going to show you one that you do not want to get. So you'll see this is uBlock Origin, right? This is 34 million users. This is the original one, 4.7 stars, 33.9 thousand reviews. It's amazing. It's good. Check out the developer. Okay, so if you go into the, the Chrome Web Store, and this is the one I'm talking about here, but if you search uBlock, I just want to show you guys, you'll see this show up. Do not get this one. I also tried this one. You see it has 3.6 stars and it's, oh, it's made by a verified uh, like developer and it's got a blue check mark. It's great. Now I installed this and I tried it on YouTube and YouTube was still playing ads. And it's actually right here. And all you have are like pause or play. That's the only two options you have. You don't see all the ads that were blocked like uBlock Origin and Honestly, like, what's the point in these two buttons? Shouldn't they do the same thing? You pause it, you're allowing ads on the site. You click this, you allow ads on the site. It's stupid and it doesn't even work. So don't get this one. Sorry for the, if the developers are watching this video, harsh review, but like it doesn't work. Just fix your app or fix your extension. Anyways, let's, let's show you one that works. So search up ad block on the Chrome web store. Actually, let me show you how to get to the Chrome web store. So if you're not here, how to get to the Chrome Web Store, you go three dots, you go extensions, manage extensions, or you can actually go the three dots and then you can click visit Chrome Web Store. But either one has the option for the Chrome Web Store here. So now that we're on the Chrome Web Store, let's search add block plus. Check this one out, 185,000 reviews, 4.4 stars. This is a good alternative. So try this one out, add it to Chrome, Add extension, 43 million users. It's about on par with uBlock Origin. The only difference is it doesn't block ads on absolutely everything like uBlock Origin did. Sometimes, you know, companies may sign contracts with these guys and let ads go through. I'm not sure what happens. Maybe they just miss some sites. And there's also like, um, there's surveys that it does that you can ignore with premium, I think, right? Yeah, something like that. Anyways, so now that Adblock Plus is installed, we can see under the extensions right here, we'll see all the ones that have been installed here. You can pin Adblock Plus now, so you can just see it. And we can click on it, and there's a lot more options that that other extension had. So automatically, we can block ads on this web, this website, this page, um, and then it shows you the total amount of ads blocked, just like uBlock Origin was doing. So. Let's try this out on YouTube. Um, I want to go on my YouTube channel here. Tech tips. We're going to watch a video and see if any ad pops up. Oh, why didn't that just pop up there? It says eight just or blocked. Let's try that again. Maybe I need to reopen Chrome here. Okay, so that one was blocked. Maybe I needed to refresh this page. Let's try this again. Okay, I'm gonna load some more videos here just to make sure that no more ads are popping up. Okay, sorry about that first video. I don't know why it loaded an ad there, but it seems like ads are actually being blocked now by the extension. I was worried, I'm like, no, I made this whole recording and now it's not gonna block ads on YouTube? Why, what's going on? Okay, so now it's blocking ads on YouTube. We've seen the total amount blocked. 
I don't think, I think maybe there's multiple per video it's blocking, so that's why, because I haven't loaded 18 videos, but there we go. It's working on YouTube. It's similar to uBlock Origin, maybe not as good, because it has all these uh, annoying little pop-ups here, and um, it will ask you for surveys, I think, and yeah, there's some improvements. It asks for a paid version, but it's still pretty good, so I recommend checking this one out. Um, I'm going to make a video on how to continue using uBlock Origin as well. But yeah, drop a like if you found this video helpful. Drop any questions you got in the comments or any improvements you guys got, any suggestions. I'm down for a discussion. And don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.